The time has come. We're gonna get this, uh, get my new go-kart unloaded. Looks like we got a little bit of work to do with the chain and some things like that, but doesn't look like it's anything too terrible bad. A few little things here and there. So, let's see if we can't get her done. Hey Matt, Charlie, yeah. come give me a hand. Some of this stuff out of the back of the pickup. Grab that thing of bolts right there. Okay, getting things unloaded. Matt's getting my pocket rocket out. I don't have the foggiest clue what I'm going to do with it out here on the gravel, but hey, we're going to find out anyways, I guess. Might find something to do with it. Here, scooch that to the side. It there. Yeah, pretty much. Kind of a neat little... Those are kind of neat. I don't know. I get the go-kart running first, and then I'll... What? So now that makes more sense to me. Oh, yeah. I didn't see the piston on that side. Okay. It's not that heavy. Just uh, here, I'll jump up on the front. You and Matt grab the backside. And I'll steer it out, or kind of steer it out, I guess. Okay, whoa. Um, here, Matt, come grab the other side. You set that down. Just, uh, we'll grab it right here. And there we go. Set her down. Okay. Now I just got to see if I can get the tires to hold some air and uh, hook some stuff up. We'll see if it runs. Oh, joy. Okay. We got it all put together. I put the carburetor on. I don't have an air cleaner for it. I had to build a little linkage in here so that the throttle will work. And then I uh, had to hook the chain up underneath. And I had to put the muffler on. So we're going to go for the first start. Let's see how this bitch, how this girl runs. Oh, get in it! Get in it! <laughs> well, it works, people. It works a lot better than it apparently should. Give her the onion! <laughs> I think I gotta adjust my idle a bit! <laughs> Crap! As you can see, the, the damn thing will drive. <laughs> um, okay, gotta adjust my idle. <laughs> okay, now that we've got the roll key bolted on <laughs> and the idle set, see I'm not moving now. We can try this again. That's right, you're coming down the hill. It should go right in, right? What? You're on the hill, you should go right in, right? Yeah. Yeah. No, no, not yeah, happening. Right. <laughs> I'm actually got a little mat power. I'm actually impressed. You know, I thought for a six and a half horse, I thought it was gonna be a flipping dog, but 
not that bad. Still needs something a little bit bigger, but we can do it this for now. Okay, here's the old chain. Nasty. But we get to digging through the drawers and it looks like we've got brand new 40 chain here. And I found some links. We're gonna put together a new chain for this for my uh put together some new chain for my new go-kart. Oh yeah, dude. I I'm not kidding when I tell you guys I keep stock out here. There's a reason. We're 25 miles from town, man. And we work on all our own shit. Well, see, that's another thing about my dad's farm I don't like, is the fact that every time something breaks, we have to go to town. Oh, Jesus. Like, oh, there's a pulley out from all the idler on the combine for the belts. And yeah. Dad runs the town and we'll comes back two hours later. Well, then, or the, you get the wrong one. That's the worst thing. Yeah. You're oh God, I know. You gave the exact part numbers, and they give you the wrong fucking one. You come back out and go, oh shit. Yeah, that's why we keep stock out here, so we can fix anything, just about anything, anytime. So I see we got got a cut off at that link there. So I got. Wait a minute, did I bring my chain breaker over here? Hope so. Damn it! Bring my chain breaker. My breaker. No, that looks like to be honest. Oh shit. Oh, yeah, dude, never mind. Yeah, yeah. I was gonna say, you dumbass. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh. Here we go. We are going to snip it right here. So, we'll snip this chain and uh, get it on and go back for another ride. See if it goes better this Okay, time. let's give this another shot. Look, behind the wheel. Thanks for that. Nice.